I suppose first off, are you happy to have the week off, I suppose, considering the intense league campaign you've had over the last while? Uh, yeah, I think it was. It was a good period to um, to recover and to um, sort of any little niggles or injuries anyone had. I think um, it was, uh, I think it was four, four games in ten days. Mm. So it was a real, um, really tough period, high intensity period. So um, I think having having the week off uh, in terms of the league matches was was beneficial, and also obviously the the Monster Senior Cup game, which uh, a lot of lads were able to get minutes in. Um, I think it, it was really benef beneficial week, really. And given the rain, I'm sure you were glad you weren't out there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it was um, it was a terrible night, really, like bad conditions, but. Um, you know, great crowd again turned out really for like in uh, circumstances. I talked to lads some well. So it's good. I suppose it's after we got there, kind of rearing to go for the league now back back into it. That's it, yeah. You know, it's um, you know, we had enough time off really, like, you know, uh, ready to go now again and um, another tough game for you there. Is there a worry kind of that your momentum might have been disrupted by not playing the league game last um, week? maybe yeah, but I think I think you know, um, you know I wouldn't be too worried about that. Um, I think it was more, we looked at it as more as a, as a positive thing really. A new back four this season, obviously, and if you take our note of it at 24, you're kind of the old men of the, <laughs> the rest really in orange. Yeah? That's it, Charles yes. was, and um, it was only last year really, I was kind of the new face, and I was, I was kind of looking up to the lads next to me, but um, I think, um, you know, I kind of a bit of responsibility now really to, to, to be a, such a senior kind of member in the back four because it is so young like um two lads being only 20 but um you know it's good i think anyone that steps into to the back four like um is well capable of of performing like and uh, knows their job which is important they're settled in well haven't they connor and and sean particularly yeah they have i suppose so it might be a surprise to some people but i think you know everyone around here you know kind of I'd say expected it really because you know we, we know how good they are and uh, how well they can they can do in training and stuff. So um, it wasn't really surprised to a lot of us really that that they came in done so well. Shane, you you said after the, the Rovers game about the the work you've been doing, Liam Carney, like is is the defensive side of your game the, the biggest difference between the player you are now and the player you were a year ago when you when you arrived? Uh yeah, I'd say I'd say so. Yeah, um, I think. Probably physically as well, I've probably developed um, a bit more. Obviously, there's a lot more to go, but I think um, I think that's not our aspect of my game. That's kind of improved, but um, definitely, yeah, I think um, it's a side where, as I said, um, after all, it's like it's not a just, like you don't have a choice whether you can be a good defender or not. You know, you have to. That's your job. You have to be a good defender. Never mind. Um, anything after that is kind of a, a bit of a bonus, I suppose. So um, it's something I'll continue to work on, and I think it's something I've I've um, gotten better at. But there's, there's still a lot more, a lot more to come. And, and the physical side of it, like John has often said, how players who come back from England find it a surprise, like the how, how tough it is to, to play in the League of Ireland. Like, is that something you found? Uh definitely. Yeah, I suppose. Um, you know, playing over, it's kind of um, with a lot of lads you're, they're, they're similar age to you, and. Um, Developing football, I suppose, is kind of a lot of, um, you know, learning how to play, play from the back and stuff. So you wouldn't get as much uh, physical encounters and physical, I suppose, headers and stuff. So you know, um, it is a, it's a big change, right? And it's, um, I think it is, a, it's, a, it's a transition that takes a bit of time as well. You know, you can't really just go from one to the other. So uh, it does take getting used to. You're also uh, running out of. Uh Change manager, have you been keeping an eye on them like since you left? Uh, a small bit, I would. I'd, uh, I'd be in contact with a few of the lads that are still there. Like, um, I suppose they're not on a great on the farm. I think it's only one win in the last maybe 17, 18 games. Like, so it's, um, it's this position I don't think they were expected to be in. But um, you know, a uh, new manager again, so it's probably a new, a bit of breath, uh, breath of fresh air, I suppose, kind of thing, and. Um, you know how they react to to that a new face, new voice. Would you ever see yourself going going back uh, to to England? Um, I'd, it's something I'd like to do, yeah, uh, uh, in the future. But at the moment, to be honest, all I'm I'm a focus on is uh Coxley here. You know, I'm really enjoying it, and um, somewhere I can see myself improving and enjoying playing and hopefully being successful as well. Like so, it's it's a perfect club really for me. I think.
the relationship with Kieran as well is developing, isn't it? Like he's he's kind of in on done pre season and Yeah, definitely yeah. Um it's you know, even in training I think we kinda of play alongside each other most days, like so it's um uh getting used to you know, what he likes and what I like. I mean we also talk about it a lot, like, you know, what we should have done how we could have done better in certain situations and stuff like and it's great really because he's a very high quality player like so um, he's a bit of a full back stream really to play behind like because you know he's given the ball and off he, he, um, he goes I suppose and so it's, it's, it's great to play with him right.